<laughs> Hello! People, my name is Kale Boss. Hmm? The only boss. <laughs> oh, wait, what is? Ah, have you heard? Wait, do you know that Tap Tap Send is live in Texas? Oh, you didn't know. We went to New York. Now we are live in Texas. So people in Texas and around, all you have to do is to download Tap Tap Send. Yes, Tap Tap Send has become the most unique, secure, and fast way of sending money across the world to your loved ones anywhere. Okay? So download Tap Tap Send on Google Play Store or App Store. And when you're in Texas or around, you just have to put in the code TXGH. What did I say? T X G H and you get ten dollars for your first transaction you make. But yeah, my hammer made it. Texas, you drew huh? Very soon we will conquer everywhere. <laughs> Download Top Top Send now on Google Play and App Store. Top Top Send, it's secure, convenient, easy, and fast. <laughs> A Becker Group of Companies and Sami Flex TV present September to Remember. And in September to Remember, Dubai tour with Sami Flex. Eti ye mwa kwenye na honi yako Dubai. Na mwa kwenye wa nisu adie. Na fe ya sansu wa jie ni abu. Na yebeko tour of places biti se. Desert Safari. Dubai Frame. Atlantic's Water Park. Dubai City Tour. Na fe yach party nisu tuye tia. Na ya sansu wa party in the cloud. Eti ye mayen kwa mani ya mekanchero. Da bi ya ye September to Remember. Dubai tour with Sami Flex. Na ye basu 24th September. Di kwesi 29th September. Anne. And for any reservation. And now send you the Chirimubia. And your friends are home at True 0243-514732. And now plus 971-559-494061. Proudly sponsored by Sankofa Restaurant. Taste Africa. On Hineba my TV. And now for EDK Media. September to remember Dubai tour with Sammy Flex. Ebe ye kikim. Well, sometimes I want to respect everybody that I come into contact with at every point in time. Anyone that I come into contact with, I want to respect them. That is why I don't know how to be selective on people to deal with. I interact with everybody. As much as you move to me, I'll interact with you. I'll not ask your background, who you are, how much money you have, or what your social status is before I'll start dealing with you. The moment you are able to make the move, I know that you want to be with me or you want to be around me. That's why you've come. And therefore, I do that with you. But sometimes, some people take advantage of it. Sometimes, some people come and they make it look like you are less of a human being because you gave them that opportunity. Me, I keep telling people, my stubborn nature is not how I look. Sometimes when you see me, the way I talk, the way I behave, the way I smile and things. You might judge me with that. I'm stronger than that. That is how I put out myself. But within me, my stubbornness, my strength is beyond what you think. I'm beyond some things. And I'm going to tell you why I'm saying this as part of my... I read comments from people or messages from people about some things and ask them, what exactly do they want from me? I ask, them, I ask myself, what do they want to hear or what do they want to see from me? If people silence or bring peace, why won't you allow them to be silent? If people who will just be quiet, minding their business, will bring peace, why don't you encourage that? But rather, you would want to encourage war. Well, welcome to the editorial. This is Sammy Flex, and I'm doing this with my people, Digital Rasta. Call him Currency, who is on camera, Richie Flex, is the editor director of the show. And if you are here for the very first time, the editorial is Sammy Flex's uh, way of um, showing his trust, belief, knowledge, and uh, perspective on the issue. So, but I can even say my expertise in this area of show business here in Ghana and beyond. And I do that on Sammy Flex TV. So many of them that you can enjoy later if you have time. That is if this is your first time here. But remember to subscribe to us because this is the home of quality showbiz information and more. Once again, you are welcome. Tap Tap Send is one of our partners on this channel. Or better still, one of our sponsors on this channel. 
and what they are offering you is to give you the opportunity to send money from abroad to Ghana. Tap Tap Send is just an app. All that you have to do is to download this app on your phone. And when you do that, you put in your bank details. You use the promo code SAMIFLEX. And with this, you are surely good to go. Do it today and thank me later. You'll be so happy you did. Let's go on to the issues and hit it straight as we have to hit it. So a gentleman who's I, who I don't know, whose identity I have no knowledge about, hit me on Instagram and said, Sammy Flex, I wish I could read it. Uh, let me see. Because I didn't save his name. I don't know how long or how soon it will take me to do this, but I wish I see it. I just wrote okay to him. I did not say much. I just wrote okay to him. I did not mean to respond to pay attention more. That's why I did not I did not keep it. Because I just wanted to let it pass. Um <laughs> Let me see if I can get it still. I'll be glad if I do. I'll be glad if I do very well. Okay. I think I've seen it. Hmm. <laughs> so sometimes you even want to believe that this person just activated this. I'll give the screenshot to my director to show you. Sometimes you even think that this person just activated this thing just to come and misbehave. And as to what he or she wants to achieve... Maybe I'll help him to achieve it. No two ways about that. And I have been saying that, you see, when it comes to celebrities, when it comes to musicians, we would have to respect them, whether big or small. And, and I'm a believer of that. I respect every talent, whether big or small. And when these people come to do this, if you are not careful, your words, if you are not careful, your reaction, if you are not careful how you would respond, will not rather hate them or hurt them, but to go a long way to hurt those people who are not people you are to even touch. To hurt those people or to hate those people who you should show love, kindness, and support to. But unfortunately, I don't know why some people sometimes, they just want to cause confusion and be happy. Maybe they just want to try you. And everything has its elasticity point. You stretch, 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 stretch. One day you hear, tap. To be torn. That's how it is. So this guy came and he wrote, Blacko is breaking the internet with his new songs and no reaction on Sammy Flex TV. If it was negative news about him, who? You will be happy and be talking about it. Blacko is breaking the internet with his new songs and no reaction on Sammy Flex TV. If it was negative news about him, you will be happy and be talking about it. First of all, Sammy Flex TV is not known to be doing reactions. I remember when one of my staff members was here, Lapiji. Lapiji was the guy I gave the opportunity to be doing that. So from time to time, he'll come and do that, and we'll just do the reviews and we put it out. It is even not the main reaction from people like Kojo Sheldon and um, 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 Kod Miki and the headless YouTuber. Thank you, Currency. It is not like them. No, we don't do it like that. I don't know when someone released a song that I came here to do me. I came here to do reaction. No, I don't do that. Anytime somebody releases a song that comes with some stories or that comes with some news, then I come here to do it. I've even seen um, this guy. My own guy, um, Van Dyke, was saying, oh, Stone Boy's song with um, um, Bob Marley. Why am I not talking? I said, oh, what do I have to say about it? Yes, I, I think in one of my editorials, I mentioned that Stoneboy has released a song, and that's all I can do. That's all I can do. I can't do much because I don't do reaction like others do. So if he comes like, he's breaking the internet with new song, and if it was negative, what does he mean by if it was negative? Where negative means what? And sometimes, you see our mind, the, what we wish for, is what we get. It is true. Black Sheriff has released a song. Or has released some two songs. You can still call them single. One called Yaya KK. And the other called Sima Down. These are songs that are even yet to be one week old. 
These are songs that personally I have been monitoring their growth. I can show screenshots of me asking um, 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 Koskoli. Because Koskoli is that guy who is always interested in numbers on Spotify. I have asked him that, oh, how are Black Horse songs doing? And he has been giving me some updates because I want to maybe at the right time come in to do the review of the song and not even reaction. I mean, I don't do reaction. That is not my business. To do the reviews of the song and that would be what I would want to do. But when you see some of these things, then ask yourself, what do they want you to see? Because, you see, sometimes if people are not talking about something, maybe it is because of something. There are some reasons why nobody would just rush to talk. Because me, I sit here thinking about a young talent. I sit here always praying for him. I sit here hoping that he'll get things right so he moves on. Because where he has got into, it is one of the difficult areas in his career. I remember last year when the VGMAs were going on and all those things, I told some people that, me, I wish Black Unity on this platform. Those who really watch me, they will know this. I told some people that, no, I feel it is too early and Black Sheep was too young for me to be winning Artist of the Year. I said it. And those who pay attention to me, they will listen to me. They will know this. Those who don't want to listen, that is their problem. And I don't care. I don't care. You can come and say it. If I think it is necessary, I'll come and respond to it. It's like I'm, I'm doing now. If it is not necessary, I'll just leave it there and let it go. Just like that. At this stage, what he needs is the support and love of everybody. And not this kind of vibe. At this stage, what he needs is the love and support of everybody and not this kind of vibe. Because one, the moment you win the artist of the year thing, expectations on you always go up. Things that people will see as normal, the moment you win some of these things, their expectation, their task on you becomes bigger. And all these things people don't do. You see, on an ordinary... If, if all these songs Black Sheriff has released, the Yaya KK and the Sima Down, if these songs had come before winning of the Artist of the Year, I'm sure like the hype, the support, the noise would be more. But after winning the Artist of the Year, everybody who is watching me should be objective and should know this. The hype and the noise around it is not like before. And it is because of all these little, little things. If it had been before the artist of the year win, like the moment he put that song, pick, 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 pick. but now some people think that, oh, we are done supporting him. He's won the ultimate. Now, yes, he should be, he should just chill. So that hunger to support him, that hunger to push him, that hunger to do all these things, they are not there anymore. So if you really love Black Shave, you don't be sending this unnecessary message to me because it won't affect me. No, it won't. If you really love Black Sharif, you will not be doing this. If you really love Black like I'm sure you will send me, oh, Brass Army, can you post this? Then me, I'll post because anytime somebody from anywhere has sent me materials about any artist or whoever, I willingly post them. I willingly do. So if you really love him, like I'm sure like by now you've gone to take some portion of the song with some video be oh brother Sammy, please post for me then if Sammy Flex does not post you can now go ahead to write this garbage you've you've sent to me if really you love black sheriff you're not commenting if it is negative what is negative me as a journalist a new story breaks and you think I shouldn't talk about it I should come here and do like this because to you it is negative that is nonsensical Every other artist whose story will break me, I'll talk about it. If I don't talk about it, my panel members talk about it. And nobody can stop me. Nobody. However you think is your problem. However, hey, me, you, people can say I hate everybody because me, I know people who even sometimes, fans who sometimes say I hate Shatawali. So you saying this will not kill me. I know some fans who come and say, eh, why did you do this? Yes, they, because to them, every time you say something that they want to hear, or you do something that they want to hear, so if, they, if you don't do it, then you are, you are going to die. No, I don't, I, like, I'm not moved by those things. Yes, Black Sheriff will support him. Black Sheriff will love him. Black Sheriff will want him to grow. 
But if you love him, this is not how to support. I always have a problem with fans that instead of supporting their talent, they rather fight people. If you fight people, you are not supporting them. If you fight people, you are not supporting. You are wasting the energy. Use that energy to push the song. Well, let's forget about all those things. And like I'm saying, I'm appealing to each and everybody. If you're a believer of the Black Hole Dream, he needs your support now than ever. If you're a believer of the Black Hole Dream. Because remember, when he won the, 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 the Artist of the Year, I came back and I said, I pray that his reign will still be on so that he can even win it again, to break that jeans. I said it here, that I pray that after winning, that drive will be on, pack, 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 pack. then he can even win it again. Then we go like, wow, this is what we are talking about. But at this stage, so many energies in pushing him will be down because they think, oh, so are we near we? He's won it already, so what else? Let him be. No. Guys, that is why so many artists, after winning Artists of the Year, they dip. And I remember Black Sherry said on, on C C uh, City TV some time ago that, man, man, man do it, man no dip. <laughs> so don't, don't let us do these things for him to dip. Rather, we should push him up still. The energy should be raising him. And me, I'm happy that he's released this song. After releasing this song, he himself, he's not even relenting. He's doing so many things to push it. Including these videos that he's done. Let's watch some of them. Steady acting like the Nobi. Big smile on your face, sisters. Okay, care as we show me. Show me. But be nice and say, Oh, my, I pay my dues and no be. No be. They try to calculate my moves and no feet. Well, to be bold, I don't care about who you're Yeah. We don't need the man to believe. We don't care about who we're gonna see. Once we're seen as we believe, we're on the winning side of the sea. We don't need the man to believe. We don't care about who we're gonna see. Once we're seen as we believe, we're on the winning side of the sea. Simmer down. I think from Babylon, tell me, boy, simmer down. I know you are losing your mind, but cool it down, pal. I think from Babylon, tell me, boy, simmer down. Yeah, so all these videos are things Black Sheriff is doing to maintain the momentum of the song. It is not easy. I'm telling you, Artist of the Year, that's why some of the people say if you win Artist of the Year, there is a case. There is no case. So the moment you win Artist of the Year, the expectation becomes so huge on you. People that will take some things from you 
normally and um, promote it as usual. The moment you win all these things, they start seeing you in a different light. So all these songs, they are songs that I'm sure like by now noise, but let's be honest. The hype around it, the noise around it is not like before. Yaya KK, this is a pure street song. Are the street people singing it? Coach Lee gave me the numbers on, uh, on, on um, um, Spotify the last Saturday that I asked him. And yes, that I think that was about some three days and the songs were doing 100 and something, something, something. They were all cool. Like, they were all cool, part of the growth. So let's maintain the momentum. Let's support him. This kind of negativity won't do the magic for him. I love him. I would never hate Black Sherry for anything because I'm not in any competition with him. Me, I don't sing, oh. And I'm not ready to sing. I won't sing. Even if God gives me a song, I'll give it someone to sing. I won't sing. So competition for him to do what? Nah. I pray that we put all this negative. He needs hey, He needs us more. Because he's so young. And I always pray for these. If you come to my office, ask my people. I tell that Charlie, me, my prayers for the young talent too. The Yao Togs and Kweku Flakes and all those people, Charlie. Because if they are not able to continue their momentum, they are dead. And their frustration will even be more. Somebody like Shatawa, Lisa, Kodia, Stoneboy, and the Samini and those people. Today, if nothing is happening for them, they've had enough time. At least they have done like a decade, a decade, a decade, and some of them are even doing too. They are fine. They've tasted everything stardom will bring, everything music will bring. But the young guys who are two, three years, less than five years old in this business, should they start going down? The hits are not coming. The love and the support, they are not coming anymore. The frustration that will come on them, you guys have no idea. So if you love him, there's not a message to send. Anybody who thinks he loves an artist, on, I'm ending this. Anybody at all who watches Sammy Flex TV and the person feels he loves an artist, this is what I want you to do. Anytime you get a material of this, your artist, send it to me. Brother me post it. Brother me say this. Don't tell me if it is negative. I'll do it. No, that thing, it is nonsense. Because one, I don't create stories for any other artist. I don't create problems for any other artist. But when the story breaks, I'll, I'll share them. Let me use my brother Van Dijk as an example. He's in the UK. Anytime he thinks, oh, there is a material that is good to talk about, he can push it to me with something. You can talk about this. And a good number of them. Sometimes some of the Beam Nation fans and oh, they send me material. Suck me. But if you can't say, you, if it is negative, no, you did not help your guy. Learn from this. And any other person who has this mindset, learn from this. If you learn to help you, me, I can come here, use this as content to even cash out. But you, what did you get? What did you do for your guy? Let's push him. Let's post the videos. Let's support him. He needs us more now. Else, the story will not be good moving forward. Now, I'm sure today, if you are to look at people who are to win Artist of the Year, if we, today, we are in August, if you are to look at people who are to really topping the music charts and all those things, I'm sure you don't mention Black Sheriff, no matter how you love him. You're mentioning Stoneboy, um, 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 Kim Promise, maybe the Kelvin Boys and those people. You don't mention Black Sheriff, and that should be your concern. Not me hating him. That is not necessary. A word to the wise is enough. Those who have ears, that is why I keep saying, those who have ears, listen. But if you want to continue fooling, I wish you well. When the trumpet sounds, we will see you. Summit Flex, I'll meet you again in the evening for Showbiz Daily. I am out of here.